In the early hours of September 9, 2017, a seemingly ordinary night out with friends took a harrowing turn for 19-year-old Kanika Jenkins. The events that unfolded at a suburban Chicago hotel would later become the focal point of a true crime case that captivated the public's attention and raised numerous questions about the circumstances surrounding her tragic death. This video delves into the timeline of the Kanika Jenkins case, the investigations that ensued, and the lingering mysteries that persist. Kanika Jenkins, a young woman with a vibrant spirit, joined friends for a night out at the Crown Plaza Hotel in Rosemont, Illinois, to celebrate a birthday. The group gathered in a hotel room for a party, and as the night progressed, Kanika's friends realized she was missing. Concern grew as they searched the hotel, and the situation took a dark turn when they discovered the young woman's lifeless body in a hotel freezer. Around 12.30 p.m. on September 10, 2017, hotel staff found Kanika Jenkins inside a walk-in freezer in an unused part of the hotel. The discovery sent shockwaves through the community, prompting immediate speculation and questions about how she ended up in such a tragic situation. The Kanika Jenkins case quickly gained traction on social media, with users sharing the story and theories about what might have happened that fateful night. The widespread attention brought national scrutiny to the circumstances surrounding her death, leading to public demands for a thorough and transparent investigation. Local authorities initiated an investigation into Kanika Jenkins' death, aiming to determine the events leading up to her tragic end. The Rosemont Police Department conducted interviews with witnesses, collected surveillance footage, and analyzed evidence from the hotel room where the party took place. One key element of the investigation was the surveillance footage from the hotel's security cameras. The footage, released to the public, showed Kanika Jenkins wandering through the hotel in a disoriented state. The footage fueled speculation and raised questions about the timeline of events, the involvement of others, and the circumstances that led her to the freezer. The Cook County Medical Examiner conducted an autopsy to determine the cause of Kanika Jenkins' death. The official report concluded that she died from hypothermia, with alcohol and drugs contributing to the tragedy. The medical examiner ruled the death accidental, a conclusion met with skepticism by some members of the public. The handling of the case by law enforcement fueled public outcry and protests, with many questioning the transparency and thoroughness of the investigation. Activists and community members called for a re-examination of the circumstances surrounding Kanika's death, demanding accountability and justice for the young woman whose life had been cut short. In the wake of Kanika Jenkins' death, her family pursued legal action against the hotel, alleging negligence and inadequate security measures that may have contributed to the tragic outcome. The civil lawsuits sought answers and accountability, challenging the official narrative surrounding the events of that night. The Kanika Jenkins case became a breeding ground for conspiracy theories and speculation, with some suggesting foul play, a cover-up, or criminal involvement by others present at the hotel that night. Social media platforms became forums for armchair detectives, amplifying the voices demanding a deeper investigation into the circumstances surrounding her death. The tragedy of Kanika Jenkins' death left a lasting impact on the Rosemont community and beyond. It exposed systemic issues related to safety, transparency, and accountability, prompting discussions about the responsibility of businesses to ensure the well-being of their patrons and the role of law enforcement in conducting thorough investigations. Years after Kanika Jenkins' death, the case remains shrouded in mystery and controversy. The legacy of this true crime case serves as a reminder of the complexities surrounding investigations, the impact of social media on public perceptions, and the enduring quest for justice in the face of tragedy. The Kanika Jenkins case stands as a haunting true crime mystery, marked by unanswered questions, public scrutiny, and a family's quest for justice. The tragic circumstances surrounding her death continue to captivate and disturb, prompting reflection on the role of law enforcement, the impact of social media in true crime narratives, and the enduring search for truth in the face of heartbreaking loss. As the years pass, the legacy of Kanika Jenkins persists, leaving a community grappling with the unsettling events of that September night.